welcome back to Forsting Academy. This is Nidhi and today we are here with the new topic types of sentences. So without wasting any more minutes, let's start. So basically we are having three types of sentence structure. The first one is simple sentence, second is compound sentence, third is complex sentence. In the simple sentence, we can see that it is having one independent clause. मतलब जो भी ये sentence होगा अपने आप में ये complete होगा उसको किसी और clause की requirement नहीं होगी. And इस sentence में एक subject होगा और एक verb होगा. Let us see the example. She took a cab to the airport. Now here we have she as a subject and took as a verb. And the sentence is complete in itself. So this is the simple sentence. If we are having more than one verb in a simple sentence, in a sentence, we call it simple again, like we are singing and dancing. Here, we have singing and dancing as two verbs, but still it is a simple sentence. Now, if we have more than one subject in a sentence, that is, we have compound subject, then it is also a simple sentence, like Sally and her friend are coming for the party. Now here, Sally and her friend is a subject and it is having compound subject. So whether we have compound subject or compound verb, we are going to have simple sentence. The next one is compound sentence. In a compound sentence, we will be having more than two, two or more than two independent clause. And we will use coordinating conjunction to combine these types of sentences. Let us go through the example. Here we have, I am a teacher, my wife is a doctor. Now we have two sentences, two different independent clause. And if we combine them using conjunction, then it is going to be converted into a compound sentence. Like, I am a teacher and my wife is a doctor. Now this makes a compound sentence. And if we try to split it again, we can do so by just removing an. So this is a compound sentence. The next one is complex sentence. In a complex sentence, we have an independent clause and a dependent clause. We have two clauses again, but the difference here is that one independent and one dependent. They can be combined using subordinating conjunctions like when, so, because, and if. So when one independent clause and a dependent clause are combined together using subordinating conjunction, they form a complex sentence. Let us see the example. When he won the award, everyone cheered. Now here we have two clauses. The first clause is when he won the award and the second clause is everyone cheered. Now we can see that the dependent clause is when he won the award and independent clause is everyone cheered. Now if you want to check whether a sentence is complex or a compound, we simply have to do one thing that is we have to split both the clauses. And if both the clauses have a complete sense in itself, then it is a compound subject, sentence, sorry. And if the both the clauses are not complete, one is complete and one is incomplete, and it is completed only when combined with another clause, then it is a complex sentence. That doesn't matter. It may have one subject, more than one subject, and uh, another at the another part, we can see it may have more than one verb as well but it should have a complete sense. So that was all for the types of sentences or the sentence structure. I hope it is clear to you and if you have any doubt, you can write it in the comment section. And uh, I wish you to share it with your friends. Do like and subscribe my channel for getting more videos on time. Thank you so much for watching my video.